eight, All right. seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fight, robots fight. Good fast box rush from Murple, which takes it straight to Black Adder. In the rock, paper, scissors of these two robots, Murple is designed to kill horizontals. Can Black Adder stay alive for three minutes? Ooh. Oh, big hit there. And you know, this is, Kyle, this is what we were talking about earlier. This is this is Purple not being afraid to get in there face first. Yeah. And taking it to any kind of high energy weapon. And this is Murple using that weapon to its ultimate advantage. I mean, just taking those hits and getting those big picks. One of the oh. big things that we know about horizontals is they don't like being tipped on their side because there's so much force, gyroscopic force, that uh, really they want to stay uh, totally parallel to the floor. So anytime you start to tip them, it's, uh, it's a bad time. But I have to say I am very impressed with the reliability of the weapon on Black Adder. Yeah, yeah it really is excellent. We got another super chat from Angel Vidal. She's at 4.99. She says it's good to be able to watch all the fights today. Been doing a lot of thinking on how I want to design my first bot for the Team Shredded fleet. Thank you so much, Angel. We can't wait to see you compete with Team Shredded. That's going to be awesome. Angel Vidal did compete on Team Shredded this year. I uh, we Angel came to the uh, the competition in July. And uh, we ran into him as he was uh, building the CAD for Shredit version uh, for Pain Train version two. Oh, I remember that. Yes, uh, Angel Very and I we were able to cool. uh, hang out at BattleBots. But we are back into this match: Purple and Black Adder. Seventy seconds left in the fight. Purple wow. still holding on to one of those little spatulas. Yeah, one of the two spatulas there. And Black Adder is looking just uh, impeccable. Yeah, really. The in drive good shape. on that robot is fantastic. You know Black Adder's having a good fight when both the googly eyes are still attached into the last minute of the fight. <laughs> That's a good point. You know, it really is a good indicator. Now Murple's front wedge is still attached. Yeah, it's up higher though. It's definitely bent out of shape. It's not where it's supposed to be. And I their think drive he's is trying a little to avoid bit. maybe rubbing on the on the ground uh, to get better traction. Uh, I think it might have just gotten a little bit distorted. We'll see. Oh yeah, you're right. It can go all the way down. Good call, Chris. Good call. Twenty seconds left here. These are two incredibly tough robots. This is no uh, secret why they've only lost one each, and they are both in round seven of this competition. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. That's the match. Turn off your weapon, Black Adder. It ran the full three minutes. That is a round of applause yeah, for round seven Yeah, that's going to action. the judges. Great job, both of these competitors. That was an excellent fight. All right, judges, friends. Murple is, uh, you know, not afraid to take it to the judges. And uh, let's see uh, which one of these bots they're going to be sending home. Let's start off with you, Andrew. Your thoughts on this fight. Murple versus Black Adder. Yeah, uh, Murple did a nice job being defensive with that plow, keeping it always toward Black Adder. Um, Black Adder is able to take off that little spatula on the front, though, kind of making their weapon, you know, uh, unfunctional, so with that, I'm going to give it to Black Adder. All right, we've got one vote for Black Adder. How about you, Jack? Your thoughts? I'm also going to give it to Black Adder. Merple wow. lost one side of their drive at one point, and they only ever really got one effective lift in, and yeah, no damage was done to Black Adder, so it has to go to them. All right, we've got two votes for Black Adder. Take us home, Don. Yeah, I'm gonna go Black Adder. You know, he just yeah. didn't die and just kept packing the plow and yeah. All right. did yeah. what they came to do. 